when you when you guys did SCTV, because it was that time in Canada's history, and because of the characters and stories you were telling, you told me a lot about my country, not in information, but who we were, and that we could laugh at ourselves by building those characters. You meant something to me as a Canadian, as mm -hmm. a performer too, because oh, these guys are funny. Mm -hmm. But you also meant you were placing me in my country in some way that helped me, that made I said, okay, we actually are a country. We're not an adjunct of Britain or US or whatever. And it was somehow f in that comedy troupe that that was one more big piece of paint on a wall for me. So, mm -hmm. okay, yeah, we do have a country. These guys are really funny. And look at, look at all these characters. Well, I think SCTV uh, had an advantage, you know, uh, because they, remember in Canada, we would get BBC, ABC, NBC, NBC uh, CBS, CBC, CTV, and Global. So we had a lot of influence. We had our Canadian influence, we had the British influence, and we had the American influence. And so, for example, Canada got the Pythons on television before it was in the United States. So I remember even uh, when I you know, finally joined Second City uh, Stage in Toronto in 1977, if you went to Chicago, you would, which was the main, where it started, Second City, uh, the shows would be very sophisticated, very um, well written, very politically astute. You weren't laughing as hard as you were being, you were admiring. Then you went to Toronto, Second City, and there'd be Robin Duke and Catherine O'Hare playing two drunk truckers driving all night drinking beer and trying to switch seats, and you would laugh hysterically. So Toronto was more character driven. And I think that was an influence of the Pythons, an influence of just, uh, s seemed s satire was stronger in this country. So it wasn't surprising that of the two companies, Chicago and Toronto, that SCTV came out of Toronto. Because it was all character driven. Why do you think satire is stronger here? Maybe because we're the middle sibling of two, threes, you know, you've got uh, Emma Thompson with England, and, uh, you know, we've got uh, Angelina Jolie in the States, and we're kind of the, we're beautiful, but we don't always believe we're beautiful. We don't wear as much makeup as Angelina Jolie in the States. We don't have the natural sophistication and wear the pearls as uh, correctly as the Emma Thompson England personality. We're the middle sister who's a little bit insecure about our beauty if we only would trust it. That's one of the best thumbnail descriptions I've <laughs> ever heard. No, that's, that's, really, that's really excellent.